Blender. I'm looking for this Blender software. There we go. Go to download. 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 If I already have it downloaded, it's not me to do that. You can probably look this up if you don't have any. Go into one of these. Or you can buy them. So I got. I got one for an example already. Gotta find one of the videos and you can go to Google Docs and download it if you want. Change your render engine to cycles. Turn the render up to like. I haven't used this so long. Camera. Gotta find camera. If your character is really big, the camera's small, so you have to make it bigger with S. Then move your mouse. Perfect. I'm such a genius. Pull it back. I'm just gonna go to find the right position. There we go. That's probably better. I can't really tell. I haven't used this in so long. It's gonna take a long time to render, so if you're trying to test, put it back down like 150. And then render see what it looks like then it loads fast but low quality so I'm not gonna oops shading now we're here on shading go to world use nodes pull them down I'm gonna Add environment texture. Boom. Put your delta, uh, your HDRI in. I use this. Put that in. Then render, and it has a background, but it looks so much better. Click on this. Click film. Click transparent. Now the HDRI is gone. There you go. Now all you see is that background. Now you have to change the color of the, uh, the flat. I guess if you want to show it, but you have to go to add mesh in the cube and then drag with X. So I'm not going to use cube. I actually use the plane and then drag with S and then rotate it. You put okay, go here, add material, base color, I'll do like green I guess, render, done, turn up the quality, I mean this one's gonna look really bad but, I didn't try with the camera or anything but it still looks good I guess. There we go. Perfect. I mean, you're always going to put more time into it, but there we go. Not bad for like five minutes.